hello everybody what is up we are vlogging i don't know why um but i am prepping for a shoot today with melanie it is currently five o'clock in the morning um i haven't been sleeping well and i had a really bad migraine last night so i fell asleep at like midnight or something and i napped a couple hours before so i have like six hours of sleep right now which is fine for my brain but yeah we're prepping for the shoot um we're doing a winter shoot and a couple Christmas photos just because I feel like it. And I'm deciding between clothing right now. So don't mind all the stuff in my room. My room is a mess at the moment because I have a lot of things that I've been doing. I also have to wrap later. But here's some clothing options right now. There's a lot. We're not taking this many photos. So I got to figure this out here. Um... This shirt I'm really tempted to use because I think it's a really pretty winter shirt. But we can use this inside because I don't want her outside in just this. This vest I'm going to need for something for sure. I have another vest in case that one is too big. This is another Christmas one I think we're going to use inside. Oops. Then we have this sweater here. The only problem is all these clothes I want to use. It is so cold out today. I don't think we're going to even be able to like see half of these clothing items so let me see this i'm gonna go with a maybe because it's a turtleneck so we'll put this here this is comfy but i don't know how much you're gonna be able to see that so we'll put this here oh my god i have so many options now some of this stuff also is in my poshmark if anyone wants to check it out um i have this sweater and then also this i think some of these are cute to layer i do want to do an outfit with either this this flannel or this one where the collar sticks out and I'm either going to use one of those sweaters or I'm going to use this sweater. So I'll put this here too. This is another layering. This is a cardigan I have. And then we have Christmas because, you know, green. Another one that's red. This is a bodysuit. And then this is just a big sweatshirt. This is going to be inside. It's giant. And this is one that is probably going to be outside. With all that being said, let me find some jackets. I have to do laundry because I don't have all my stuff washed at the moment. So first things first, I have a giant puffer jacket with a big hood. That is a must. Here's my jackets that I currently have. I have ones on the outside as well, but we'll get there in a minute. I would want denim, but I think it's too cold out to put her in denim. It might not be, so we'll grab one. Grab this guy right here. Boom. And then I also, of course, want the puffy because you gotta. Oh, my bed looks fantastic, everybody. And now... Oh, I just knocked over my tree. Um, this is an option. I'm just gonna throw this on the floor. We got that. We have this jacket. And we have this jacket right here. <sighs> I don't know how I'm supposed to decide, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. Because I don't have to choose from pants. So I'm gonna go do some laundry real quick because this isn't even everything so let me let me go do that let's turn this tree on okay i can't see the plug Ooh. let's where's the other plug here it is focus why that's not focusing there we go I just realized how weird this looks. Sorry, it's like 5 a.m. I'm trying not to be loud. That looks really weird. It's just like, whoop. I hear a truck. What truck is it? It's the garbage truck. Okay. It's so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, back to laundry. We gotta bring that. So I have all of this laundry to do. 
this whole thing here, and then this whole thing to do. And I think I have clean clothes in here. Nope, those aren't mine. Where are my clean clothes? Oh boy. I don't mind how everything looks down here. My basement's a little uh, gross. Okay. Actually, I think I should put my other clothes in here first because I think those are better. That's it. Okay, we're done now. I am going to go make myself some waffles because I'm starving. Oh, this lighting is great. This is the Santa costume we're using today. <laughs> this is so funny. Look at the glare. I really want waffles, but I don't want to wake anybody up. Me. It's fine. I'm really trying to make this quiet. I'm gonna try to cancel and then like pull this up so it doesn't wake anybody up. There's a brown sugar and cinnamon one and then a normal one. I wanted two normal, but we didn't have any left. Sad days. I really gotta time this. How many? Three and a half minutes, okay. I wanna see if I can even make this quiet. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys some of the stuff that I got for Melanie. I think I'm gonna, I don't know if I'm gonna wrap it. I kinda just put them in bags right now. Um, but I got her these MTV little socks cause I don't know why, the colors give me very Melanie vibes. I don't know if you guys remember her, um, but she is my friend who's been on this channel a ton and we have a YouTube channel together as well. But these colors, when I saw this, I'm like, she's very into music and um, everything like that. So I was like, oh, okay. These are really cute because the colors, they're pink and blue. And it's very, pink and blue is very Melanie in my opinion. Um, and then I got her this shirt from Kohl's. It's just a plain, like, black shirt. It's got a little cinching right there. And it's got, like, this design at the bottom. It was just cute, and I was like, oh, this kind of reminds me of something Melanie would wear, so sure. And then I also, I'm gonna, I just put it in a bag, so let me undo this. She is in love with Eeyore, and um, she even has like an Eeyore tattoo now, so I got her this Eeyore mug from TJ Maxx. Let me focus on it. Look how cute! I think it's so cute that he peeks out of the top and it's Christmas. I don't know. I thought it was a cute. I saw it and I was like, I can't not get this for her because the little ER on the top is like too cute. So that's when I got Melanie. Um, her birthday, I got her something else, but her birthday is next week. So then me and my family do a, we call it Jip Your Santa, but it's kind of like a white elephant. I know a lot of people call it white elephant. We call it something different. I'm in love with what I got. So our limit was $40. And I really like what I got. Um, I wish I could use it. I got it. I got it from Amazon. And it is this decanter here with the cutest little nutcracker in the middle. I'm trying to focus on it, but it's glass. There you go. And there's a cute little nutcracker guy in the middle, which I think is adorable. And it comes with four shot glasses and they'll have little nutcrackers on them. Focus, focus. Like this one has white on it. And then we have this one and this one has red. And then this one is light blue and this one is like a dark blue on the top. I think they're really, really cute. Um, it was much better than I thought it was gonna be for 40 bucks not bad at all and i think my family is really gonna like this so oh this is so annoying to get back on though oh my teeth came off also i just graduated from college so 
I got a couple gifts so far. Um, my graduation party isn't until January though, so that my friends can all be here because they're not not all of them are home from college yet. But I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So let me guys tell you about myself real quick. Um, let me guys tell you about myself. What did I say? So let me tell you guys about myself for a second. I am not, sorry if you hear an annoying sound, that would be this guy right here, my radiator making an annoying sound. But I'm not a name brand designer person. I am, if it's good enough, then cool. Um, that's just kind of how I work. But there is this bag from Michael Kors that I've wanted for so long now. Um, I mean, I don't know, since I was, I don't know how old, but I never wanted my family to spend that kind of money on a bag for me, so I never got it. And my boyfriend was a little sneaky about it, and he told his parents when they asked what to get me for graduation, they, he told them about this bag, and it was on sale apparently like 80% off. This is like a $400 bag, and I think it was on sale for like 80% off. You can do the math. I don't want to do it. I refuse. I'm really bad with percentages, so luckily I can't just do them. Um, but... Now look, I'm not like a bag person, but to have something so nice is just, I I love it. And it's silver, and not a lot of Michael Kors bags are silver. Most of them are gold, and I'm not a gold person, so I am so happy with this, because the one I currently have is black and gold, and it doesn't have any pockets or anything, which I like to keep like my key in this front pocket. I don't even think it's in here right now. Yeah, it's not, but <laughs> I like to keep my key in a front pocket so I can just grab it. And this chain is even, oh my god, I love it. And also, it's, I don't like bags that are like, have a chain here because it, in the summer, it gets really annoying. But I am so happy with that. I like, um, he made me make a list for them to like, for stuff to get me. And I put like, a $30 bag on there or something. So when I opened it, I was like, oh my god, I know what this is. Oh my god, what a surprise, you know. And then I moved... There was like paper on it and I moved it and I was like, sneaky, it was so sneaky, but I'm really happy with it. I'm really so strange for me to be so excited over a bag, but it's just, I was not expecting it. Then another thing that I wasn't expecting, this is my sword. Look, okay, so here's, here's a fun little story guys. You can't even see it anymore. Um. So I really wanted this sword for a while, just to hang up, because I think it's so pretty. Look how pretty this is. So I've been dying for it. And for a graduation gift, my boyfriend got this for me. Because he was a little more excited for it too. You know, he wanted to have a sword as well. So he kind of got it for himself. But I mean, look how cool this is. I want my camera to focus on it. Look at the detail on it. It is so cool. Um, but, so the first day I got it, it's really difficult to open it. I'm not going to try to open it right now because I'm in a weird position. But it's really difficult to get out of the casing. So, what I did was I put the sword back in and didn't put the case on all the way because I was like, oh, I'm not going to be able to get it open again. The next day, right, less than 24 hours later, I was like, Oh, I gotta go show my mom. She's gonna kill me. My mom's gonna be so mad at me. And I lifted the sword up behind my back. Like, I have my hands like this, and I put it behind my back. And the case that wasn't fully on that I forgot about slid off. Reflexes went to grab it. So I grabbed my sword, and it sliced through my fingers. You cannot see it anymore because it's been like, um, it's been a while. Let me see if we can focus on it. Yeah, you can see the marks right here. The pinky got a lot worse than the ring finger, but um, that was fun. When I dropped it, right, so my boyfriend here, when I, my boyfriend was here when I did it, I grabbed it, fell through my hand, went to grab it, and he, I literally just went, looked at my hand, and I saw on my pinky, it didn't bleed, but I can see the skin on the inside of my finger, and I just went, Hmm. Walked into the bathroom, my boyfriend started freaking out because he knows if I go silent, that's not a good thing. Um, he was like, Danny, Danny, are you okay? What happened? How bad is it? 
and I went in the bathroom, I took a paper towel and I just held it on my finger to just hold it before it started like bleeding. So I put like a ton of pressure on it to like close it up because I knew that if I didn't, it would start bleeding a lot. So I held it really, really tight. And he was like, Danny, how bad is it? You have to show me, you have to tell me. And I just was like, it's fine. It's all good, it's fine. Came back in my room and he's like, you're freaking me out. Like, how bad is it? And I said, I explained to him that I was able to like see the inside of my finger and he's like, oh, you see bone? I'm like, nope, there's no bone. It's just, I wasn't expecting to, like I felt it cut my finger, but I feel like it didn't process until I saw my hand and I was like, hmm, okay. But I was fine. I just held it there for a while. Um, my pinky opened um, one more time and then I just kept holding it closed and I had it wrapped so that it would stop like opening. But yeah, less than 24 hours and I cut myself with a sword. <laughs> it's very shocking that I did that. Um, I can actually show you guys some Christmas gifts that I got. Me and my friends um, Mackenzie and Scott exchanged gifts and i can show you guys what scott got me he got me this that 70s show little metal poster and it's got a bunch of quotes if you guys don't know i absolutely love that 70s show it is one of my favorite things in the entire world not even just my favorite show like one of my favorite things so i'm very happy about this because they don't have a lot of merch because they don't actually have like a ton besides like t-shirts and stuff um and you probably can't see it but that 70s show license plate is up there um, and that was like the only thing that I owned besides the actual series. He got me something else too, but it's a whole story to explain. Um, he's an artist and he makes a series where he bases characters off of his friends. And he was like, oh, welcome to like the crew. And he gave me something that's relevant to his story. So that was really cute. And then my friend Mackenzie, sneaky. We have been hanging out like every single day. We go on walks every day. Um, so every time we go to a store, I'm very like, ooh, I like this, ooh, I like this. And she took note of all of them and ended up getting them for me. I got this gorgeous plate that says give on it. It is for like Thanksgiving and I love it. I saw it on sale when we went to the store and she was like, um, another time we went back to the store, she goes, oh, go wait over there. And I was like, what the hell is she getting at, getting for me at like Stop and Shop? And... As soon as I saw it, I was like, oh, I'm like, what? we were by the frozen section, but it was in like a little area where there are sales. I was like, what the hell? What is she getting me in the frozen section? <laughs> I'm, I kind of forgot that I mentioned that. And then this was on my Amazon list. Uh, me and my friends make Amazon lists now. So people stop asking us what we want. And it's just like little things. So I got these Nightmare Before Christmas socks because Nightmare Before Christmas is like my other favorite thing in the world. And then she also got me, then she also got me this soap dispenser from Bath and Body Works, guys. I have been wanting this for so long and I was like, my boyfriend kept telling me, no, don't get it, you don't have a house, don't get it, you don't have a house. And I'm like, but I want it. And Mackenzie bought it for me. I, like, this is like one of my favorite things I got and it's so stupid because it's a soap dispenser, but I wish you can feel this. The material is so nice if you drop it it's probably gonna break like what is this like ceramic also i went to the paper store last night and i bought a puppy dog <laughs> so i'm totally not 22 years old and i bought a stuffed animal but this is a dog that i want and i want to name this dog dicaprio and to call him little cap but um i saw him in the store and i had like a 30 percent off and i was like okay let me just get it so I could call him DiCaprio. So when I have this actual dog, I call him DiCaprio. <laughs> I also bought this, which is so cute. It's a little snowman and it's a spoon holder. And I still don't have a house of my own yet or an apartment of my own, but I have a lot of things for it for when I do. Also, I did this on TikTok and I didn't think it was it would work, but it did. So, um, there's this app called Fetch, if you haven't heard of it, where you scan receipts and at a certain point you can get like gift cards to certain places and stuff. I just got my first $25 Amazon gift card. It does take a while, but you get there at some point because you just scan receipts. It's not based on the amount that you have or anything. It's based on what you buy. 
You can check on the app if there's any special deals and stuff. I'll put my referral code on the screen where you'll get 2,000 points for free once you scan your first receipt. So, uh, this isn't sponsored or anything, but I just wanted to mention it because the, refer the referral code gives us both points. And um, I posted that on my TikTok for a day in my life video and somebody used it and we both got points and I was so happy about it. So I got a $10 Amazon gift card. Um, but yeah, okay, so that is everything I got so far. Um, maybe I'll make another vlog at some point because next week is so busy. So maybe I'll do like a little weekly vlog and show you everything that I got people for Christmas and wrap and all of that good stuff. And then maybe after Christmas, we'll do what I got for Christmas. I know I'm like 22 doing what I got for Christmas, but I absolutely love what I got for Christmas videos. I don't care. I love them. I'm just curious. I like to know what people got. I'll see you guys in like, um, probably when Melanie's here, honestly, because I got stuff to do and all of that's boring and you don't want to watch it. So I'll probably record when Melanie gets here. So yeah, see you in, well, I'll see you in the next clip. All right, let me uh, oh, throw it back. <laughs> Oh, I'm in a weird position. That's what she said. <laughs> Throwback to every time I say anything, Melanie says that. I'm back with Melanie. Melanie's Hi. over here. It's been how how many long do you think it's been? How since many it, long? How many long? <laughs> yep. How long do you think it's been since you've been in like a, a vlog? I feel like it's been a year or two. It's well, I haven't posted in two years. Then it's been two years. Yeah. Because I, I guess think the last video I remember was like the Christmas trivia game we played. Yeah, which I actually was... packed the shirt that I wore in that video. For the, really? Yeah, just because it's Christmas colors. Oh yeah, they they the vlog knows. I I'm preparing for the shoot. I was up since five thirty in the morning because I had a migraine last night and I haven't been sleeping. So I fell asleep at like midnight last night and then woke up at five thirty and just stayed up and prepared for things. So <laughs> I've been up with them since five thirty oh, wow. in the morning, wow. making waffles, doing laundry. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've literally, that's what I've been vlogging since like 5 o'clock in the morning. But we have our little Christmas gifts. You guys already know what I got, Melanie, because I showed them before. Oh, wow. But you want to open at the same time? Sure. I have the main Which, focus. Is on. there one you want me to open first? Maybe these. Okay. Uh, they're all kind of simple things, nothing crazy. Yours is simple, so. <laughs> so much wrap it up for tissue paper. <gasps> oh my god! I wanted this, so this game! <laughs> Wait, is this in my thing? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> but I figured it'd be fun for us to all yes. apply to. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, I could probably wear this today. I, I needed like a new shirt too. Really? Like, perfect, yeah. I was like, it kind of gave me Melanie and vibes. And I love these socks, because these are like all my oh, favorite nice. colors, and I needed new like, nice socks. So That's what, I literally said it in the vlog. I was like, I have to get these, because they just gave me Melanie vibes to <laughs> the colors. <laughs> oh my God, these socks are so, oh, they're out, I'm so dumb. <laughs> I just thought they were Christmas socks. Oh my god, I can wear these with my elf. I, I bought the elf Christmas sweater for the party. <laughs> I don't want to break well, it. Like, yeah, Scott gave me that bag, so I just used it. I looked at, this is five below. Yeah. I looked at this exactly. I got it because I was thinking of the movie Cloud Nine. <laughs> really? Yeah. I actually looked at this because I wanted more lights in my stream. Oh. I, it was so oh cute. My God. I couldn't not. Yeah, it's so cute. And then of course, yeah. gummy bears because <laughs> Melanie gets these uh, gummy bears every. Are they are these different? Ones? Yeah. Oh, and because they're red and green, so that's another reason why. <laughs> they're also just the best gummy bears in the oh. entire world. I know. I saw that and I was like in line and I was like, oh, I have to get this because there's you. a little ewer sticking out of the oh top. Oh my God. Thank you. I'll take a picture. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Thanks, Melanie. So <laughs> we never hug, guys. <laughs> we're, literally, we were just talking about that. How, like, me, Meg, and Mackenzie, and you, we all don't hug each other. The only person, like, we hug is, like, the Scots or something. Yeah, and that's that really it. Too, yeah, that was from other Scott. Scott got me a Scott P. Got me a That 70s Show thing, like, with, here, wait, let me... Look, it's got all quotes Whoa. from the entire show on there. I've been to that podcast I was I was telling you about. I kind of, um, while you're back, I want you on one of the episodes. <gasps> yeah. And we could talk about, like, movies That'd and be awesome. things. Because I feel like I want different people to talk about, like, different things. 
and we could just we talk about anything though honestly because i can talk about movies i can talk about making movies like um, yeah. also how much we hate man no <laughs> mm, that too it would be like boys suck the podcast yeah like that live stream that we did oh my god the one that you showed the guys and they oh, were like yeah. yeah men do suck huh yeah <laughs> all right i'm gonna get back to you guys when we take photos they're gonna be a little behind the scenes for like cool. photos and stuff I melanie's hair from the back does not look so good because like <laughs> it's really about the front like let's like yeah 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 see the i might have to move the bun up a little bit actually oh there's buddy's bulge <laughs> I, I was just I saw you and then I just saw this right there but oh uh, hey look it's Mackenzie <laughs> <laughs> so I didn't get to actually film any behind the scenes with Melanie but I will insert some of the photos that we took here We were rushing a lot because me and my friend had to stream after um, and we just finished streaming and we I'm going to be creating a thumbnail real quick and trying to make a PNG for a trophy that we won in a game so I'm gonna try to grab that real quick here's all the lovely stream this is the stream that we just did let me focus on it we did this. Let me see if I can change the thumbnail. Yeah, there's nothing exciting for the thumbnail. But we're going to just download that. And uh, I got to wait. But once I download that, I think I'm really tired. So I don't know if I'm going to um, stay up much longer. But I want to edit some of the pictures of Melanie. And I want to like, make this thumbnail. So maybe while this is all downloading, maybe I will wrap some gifts i don't really think i want to wrap some gifts maybe i'll see you guys tomorrow with me wrapping a couple gifts and end the vlog here because i'm not doing much else it's 10 30 i'm probably gonna go to bed in a bit because i am exhausted from today me and my friend ended up not taking santa pictures we maybe will tomorrow we'll see but i'll let you know okay so it's now the next day and i am going to wrap some gifts and pack for my little weekend vacation tomorrow so let me go bring in all of the gifts that i have i don't think i want to wrap all of them but i'm going to at least try to get some of my family members and the house is done because we put those gifts all the way in the back of the tree so i kind of want to get them done first and then i'm going to pack and i really gotta figure out what i'm gonna pack because it's gonna be cold and snowing so it's gonna be really hard for me to fit all my stuff in a suitcase we'll see so these are all the gifts that i have to wrap there's quite a few um i'll go through some of them and try to show you guys like what i got other people just because why not Ooh, the lighting is bad down here but this is currently what the room looks like there's also buddy the elf <laughs> but yeah let's uh let's wrap i think now i'm gonna attempt to watch the new a christmas story christmas um i don't really like the first movie that much but everybody's saying that this movie is surprisingly good so while i wrap we're gonna watch this and see if it's actually good
So my battery's dying, guys, which means I'm probably gonna have to end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully, I'll be back. Um, I might do another video where I show what I got for Christmas. We will see, and yeah, I'll see you guys whenever that next time is. Bye.